Walking the dog is, well, the first step in a long, happy canine life. And letting them run off the leash, even better, says John Cooper, watching his Boston Terrier. You see Lily over there just living her best life. A good diet helps. Socializing with other dogs makes a difference. But what could possibly explain Bobby? A Portuguese raffero, a kind of mutt, who lived to age 31. That's like a human living to 140. He was never chained up a day in his life, said Bobby's owner, Lionel Costa. He had freedom and our love throughout his life. The Guinness Book of Records verified his birthday in 1992. And after that, Bobby roamed rural Portugal, eating natural foods like fresh fish. So fascinating that veterinarian Karen Becker spent days studying Bobby. She's co-author of The Forever Dog. It's a very simple, easy, quiet, beautiful, calm, peaceful life was the first thing that hit me. Seems like most dog owners have the right instincts. It's love, exercise, nutritious food. Then they get to run without me running. <laughs> all good things, though for Bobby, maybe something more, says Dr. Becker. I believe all of those variables and exceptional DNA was probably the perfect recipe for why he was a 31-year-old dog. Becker has sent Bobby's DNA for analysis by scientists in Hungary. To better understand that while every dog has its day, Bobby had 11,487 of them. Eric Sorensen, Global News, Toronto.